This is how to fix your CPU if it's thermal throttling. I have this problem in my games where I would be running at like 200 FPS and then after like an hour, 30 minutes of gaming, it drops down to like 150 for example. Like a huge dip in FPS. So why is that? Why does that happen? So if you go over here, it shows you how much megahertz your cores are running at. Mine is all running at 4600 something megahertz. If you do a normal CPU stress test, right here, my temperatures spike up to 80 degrees Celsius. It drops down to 3,790 megahertz. Why is that? Well, it's because trying to keep your CPU from dying, it's overheating. It has to lower the clock speed of your cores to keep the temperatures down. The temperature is at a stable 63 degrees Celsius. So that basically means my CPU is overheating. So I first take out the power supply so I don't get fucking zapped. Then I take out the GPU after taking out the fan and this as if heat pipe. If you look here at my CPU, all the thermal paste has dried up and there's barely any making contact with my CPU. I've been running this entire PC for about like a year and a half now with this problem. It's probably why it's not running at its fullest. So let's fix that using some wipes and alcohol to reveal my beautiful i7 10700F. So after dusting the heat sink and fan, for this part, I'm gonna be using cooler mess or whatever, thermal paste, and this spatula to spread out the thermal paste evenly. In here, now that I've spread the thermal paste, I will now put this heat sink back in and reinstalling the fan. I can finally put my GPU back because my i7 does not have integrated graphic. After it's in, put these cables from my monitor straight to the GPU. Now let's put this power cable back in and we boot into Windows. Now, as you can see, I've been running the CPU stress test for over, I don't know, a minute now. And there has been no drop in clock core speed or any sort of power so my cpu is running at full blast but there will be no more performance issue now that every core is running at maximum speed at all times so that is the fix